Let's shift a little bit to, to Cirrus. What are they on the cutting edge of right now? Aerodynamics and safety. They've always been there on the aerodynamic side. Yeah, uh, that parachute, that thing is oh, that's awesome. That makes me yeah. feel like, oh, I could go fly a plane, maybe, <laughs> as long as I just like can deploy the air, you know, the the, the parachute and whatever. Had, yeah, and they've had a, quite a number of deployments. I forget what the total number is now, but you you can just go on YouTube and see the deployments because people catch them falling from the sky with the parachute and landing on highways and things of that nature. But the, par- the parachute system is uh, one of the early safety features that was in the Cirrus, and it, it, it works on a rocket that's in a parachute is behind the, the, the passenger area of the aircraft, and there's straps built into the composite structure of the aircraft, so as the, the rocket shoots up and the parach- par- parachute deploys, it pulls these straps out of the the outer shell of the fuselage, I'll call it, and it ties into the metal framework that's in the middle. That's Those are the lift points for the for the aircraft, mm-hmm. and then it just drifts down to earth. That was a, a very early selling point for Cirrus, and I think it really set them apart. And also there's some there's some sort of funky legal things you'd worry about, like if someone deployed it improperly or someone pulled the handle and it didn't deploy sort of thing. So there's a lot of, you know, there's a lot, I'm sure there's a lot of, of detail work going into that system, but it's saved a lot of lives at this point because occasionally a Cirrus pilot will get in the wrong place at the wrong time or will have some sort of medical, can the pilot have a medical condition and, it, you know, a passenger will pull the parachute and land the thing. It, it, it essentially destroys the aircraft, but you can walk away from it. That's huge. And really? Why does it? Why does it destroy the aircraft? Because it's actually pulling parts of the fuselage apart, and it's it, 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 it's it, it uses the landing gear, which are always out. It uses the landing gear as part of the shock absorption system, and the landing gear just can't take the because you're falling at a pretty good rate still with the even with the parachute, you're still falling at a pretty good rate. So the landing gear kind of gets banged up pretty hard and. I, and it's just not made to take that those those stresses because it's not necessarily not landing on soft cushiony pillows <laughs> you're probably landing in a very rocky area or a very you know, wooded area so the airplane's yeah. going to get beat up as it lands in that 